What's up, guys? It's Loka back in another fucking lit, lit, lit ass video. So, today's video is going to be a what's in my stripper bag. Now, I got ready for work. This is the look. Tell me if you guys fuck with it. It's super, super, super cute. If you guys like it, let me know down in the description below if you guys want me to do a tutorial on this look. Also, I didn't do my baby hairs today, but hey. It's okay, we could leave them like that. We could leave them like that. For a day, we could leave them like that. So I'm going to show you guys what I have in my stripper bag. Not everybody has the same things in their stripper bag. Now I do have stuff missing that our club supplies us with but there are some recommendations that i'm going to tell you guys after i show you what's in my stripper bag that i don't have in there just in case you strip club do not have these things for you before we get into this video i just want to thank you guys for supporting me and following me on this journey i know it's been long getting back up and you know up and running with my mental health and stuff like that so i just want to thank you guys for being patient very 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 patient um, I'm slowly getting everything back, um, but well, without further ado, let's get into this video and make sure you like this video before you even watch it because I'm about to give you guys some tips on stripping. Matter of fact, make sure you subscribe. Okay, let's get to 4K. I'm at 3K right now. On my other page, I was at 50K. Let's get to 4K today. Let's get to 4K this week. Can we get to 4K? We're almost freaking there. I need everybody who likes this video to subscribe right now help out again love you guys and keep watching okay so what's in my stripper bag the first thing that i'm going to pull out is basically wear like stripper wear so this is my stripper bag it's pretty big and there's a lot of stuff in it mostly my heels and stuff like that but i'm going to tell you guys and show you guys everything and i'm going to show you guys tell you guys some secrets on like you know, just tips and secrets. So what's in my stripper bag? First thing. So I got a bag, I know this is a sheen bag, but I put all of my tampons in there. Yes, women do strip on the period. Not all women strip on their period. Some do, some don't. Secrets on how to stop bleeding. Um, if you guys want me to share that, I'm gonna show you guys at the end of the video how to stop the bleeding. I definitely carry a bunch of tampons with me because you never know, you don't want to be that stripper who got the period and then like is dancing on a guy. And then you get up and like, no, you don't want that. This is our first thing that was in our bag. Make sure you always, 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 always have tampons, okay? Next thing I see in my stripper bag is a clip. Sometimes you get hot. At the end of the day, you want to put your hair up. You got your, you know, you got extensions. I do, I get hot and sweaty. You could carry this around you in your stripper bag. Go in the back if you're gonna give somebody a lap dance, like in the champagne room. You know, you're still gonna be cute, but if the guy understands like you're sweating your ass off, it's okay to clip your hair up real quick and still, you know, dance. Cause you know, you don't wanna, it's just a precaution. So I bring a clip with me all the time. I got one pair of stripper heels in here. I think, I believe that these were my second pair of stripper heels I've ever bought. I like them. I just don't like how they're not loud. I don't know. This is in my stripper bag. Um, my other heels that I see in my stripper bag are these pink ones. I super freaking love these. Um, they're so cute. They're like holographic. Can you see that? And I think these ones have a louder click. If I'm not mistaken. Yeah. Cute, because you know when you're on stage, you want to... I don't know, just depending on the shoes. Next thing, I got deodorant. A dry spray on deodorant. You do not want to get the stick ones where it's going to leave marks. I always, always have this one. And this one smells so great. All the strippers use this one in my club. Um, after my boss told me to use this one, I could never stop wearing this one. So if you want to take a screenshot, make sure you take a screenshot. The best, 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 best one so far that I've been using. Next thing I have is lotion. Now, this is a hit or miss. If I'm wearing my boots, um, 
I'll put lotion like on my body area, never on my thighs and my legs if I'm on the pole. Um, I'll put it on my like arms, you know, certain areas if you're dry. This is like a hit and miss. You don't ever want to be oily. You don't ever want to be lotioned up because you can like... If you go on the pole and you're wearing lotion, that shit is so slippery and somebody can break their neck. Like I said, hit or miss. If you're not gonna work the pole that night, wear some lotion, but I bring lotion with me just in case. It is Olivera. Now I could bring Olivera with me, putting it in the inner thighs of my legs and on all of my bruises. Um, after I get off the fucking pole, I am all red, okay? Now you guys might think we're pretty, I don't know if you guys can even see that. Oh, they're like healing up though. I don't know. Vera helps take down bruises. It helps soothe, um, like, you know, soothe, like, you know, it just helps for, okay, use to soothe minor burns, skin irritations, dry, rough, and sunburned skin. It actually just makes your, like, makes your bruises feel a little cooler and like less, I don't know, it just makes it feel better. Bring, uh, the next thing I have, I see white toenail polish. Now I always wear night toenail polish. Sometimes if I'm on the floor, my it will chip. I'll make sure that I have some with me. Everybody looks at your feet. Everybody looks at your nose. Everybody looks at your nails. Everybody looks at everything about you. You gotta, everything gotta be spick and spat about you. Like it gotta be on point, on point. Next thing I got is a battery. A battery for my phone. Now, sometimes I don't want my phone in the back charging around a whole bunch of girls. I don't know. So I bring a battery with me so I could put it in my, my dance bag while I'm on the floor. That's a good thing to have. Thing is spray, again, a hit or miss. You wanna put it minorly. I put it all over the place, so I really don't give a fuck. But some guys don't like that because they're gold and you know they got wipes and if you're smelling too good you can smell that and their wipes can smell that um the last thing i have is my bag of stripper clothes this is my bag of stripper clothes i have about like 10 pairs of outfits in here they're all mixed up um it, they're all different to be honest that's really about it to be honest that was in my stripper bag um okay so certain things that i missed out on um i also have scissors in my stripper bag because the pasties there sometimes they buy just a roll of tape and we gotta make our own like pasties so i bring scissors with me all the time you always want scissors you never know when you need scissors another good thing to have in your stripper bag i just remember a shaver us girls forget everything, but we cannot forget to shave. And I know I've done it. I've been, I went to work and I forgot to shave my armpits where I looked like a whole gorilla. And no one had a shaver. So I just couldn't go to work. So I had to go back home, but make sure you have a shaver inside your bag, please. That's like a must. It's a must. You don't want to be that girl who has a hairy pussy, hairy ass crack. No, you don't want to be that one. Trust me. Sorry, y'all. I got so caught up in doing a YouTube video. I forgot I was making some chicken alfredo. Okay, so another major, 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 major thing you need to have in your bag. And I mean, it's a must. You need to have wipes. You need to have wipes. Wipes is a must, okay? You go in the back and you're dancing on dudes. Excuse me. You're dancing on dudes. That's one. Two, dumb dudes are just coming out of work. So I'm sensitive. If I'm dancing on a guy, I get pimples on my butt if their pants are dirty. And that's so unattractive, especially if a guy's trying to touch you and rub on your booty. They're gonna feel those pimples. So you always, after every dance, I suggest to go wipe yourself down. Um, there's always, get some disinfectant wipes too, the ones you can put in your hands. Um, those work too. Wipes are a must. If you have your period, you wipe yourself. You might not get the blood off of your skin. You know, sometimes we have heavy periods. 
you gotta make sure you're clean. You can take a shit because I take a shit at work. You gotta make sure the smell's gone. You gotta be fresh at all times. Wipes are gonna be your best fucking friend. Your best friend. I got a trick on having your period while working. So this is what I do. And a lot of people don't know about this trick. So I'm going to, I'm here to tell y'all um, the thing that I do when I'm having my period. So I'll grab a tampon and I'll put it up all the way. Now, you know, when you like put a tampon on, you know how you have two, like two um, gateways to like your ovaries. Well, you put your tampon in and you push the thing up until it goes to each one, to one of one or the other. Then you make sure that the tampon string is still out. Then you grab a wipey and you're gonna fold it and you're gonna fold it again and then you're gonna fold it into a tampon like this. And so it's this height and it's rolled like that. You're gonna grab the string out from your vagina and you're gonna push that inside while the string's out. You could either cut the string. I don't want you to cut the string because I usually grab the string and wrap it around my vagina lips and then you're good to go. Change it every 30 minutes and you'll be fine. Not every 30 minutes, but if it's heavy, heavy, I suggest you change it every 30 minutes. But other than that, you will be fine after that. I promise you. All right, guys, that was it for today's YouTube video. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like it, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that bell button to get all the notifications every time Loka posts a YouTube video. I really hope you enjoyed it. And if you guys have any other questions about stripper, you know, stuff like that, comment down below or I'll be putting a Q uh, question box in a story time so you guys can actually type in a question and i can write it down um i love you guys so much keep in tech and make sure you do that subscribe button hit that subscribe button please i want to get to at least 10 new subscribers today and it'll be dope it'll be dope if i could get to 4k today it'll be dope so yeah let's yeah come on guys come on love you guys see you next time bye